name is Max, and I am part of the steering and ergonomic subsystems, and I study physics here at Western. My name is Yaman Bakir, I'm on the electrical team, and I study mechatronics engineering at Western. My name is Christian Brown, I am part of the mechanical accumulator subsystem in traction, and I am going into third year mechanical engineering. Uh, my name is Keneal, I'm on the suspension system, and I'm also a team captain for this year, and I'm in mechanical engineering. Hi, my name is Dima. I am part of Aero, the Aero subsystem, and I am in mechanical engineering. My name is Drew Bear, and I'm in computer science. Hi, my name is Samia. I'm on the chassis sub team, and I'm in mechanical engineering at Western. My name is Haider Ali. I'm on the chassis sub system, and I study mechanical engineering. My name is Juan. I'm part of the suspension team on Western Formula Racing, and I'm a first year engineering student going into mechanical. And my name is Carson. Uh, I'm also on the suspension sub system. And I'm also technical director of the team this year. I study mechanical engineering at Western. My name is Andrew Valdez. I'm part of the aerodynamic subsystem and I study mechanical engineering at Western. Through the steering subsystem, the driver controls the motion of the car and can react quickly to any changes in the conditions. My subsystem gives power to the car. It is the battery, the accumulator. My subsystem is in charge of manufacturing the monocoque, which is made of CFRP in one single resin curing cycle. The aerodynamic subsystem creates the carbon fiber skins that compose the aerodynamic elements that make the car go fast in the car. The main goal of the suspension team is to optimize the mechanical grip we can get at the tires in order to get enough traction for the car to be optimal in competition. The mechanical design of the suspension system on the car. Um, we're also in charge of uh, vehicle dynamics. Things like tire selection, spring selection, um, kinematics of the suspension system. Why did you join Western Formula Racing? The real story is I was walking by the shop one day on the way to the gym and I saw that they had the door open, the garage door open, so I came in, talked to some of the old leads in my first year and because of my love of F1 and doing robotics in high school, decided to join the team since it was an extension of that. Um, I joined Formula to supplement my education here at Western and to hopefully advance my career. I joined Formula uh, to meet new people that were like-minded like me. They wanted to work on something that I was passionate about as well. I joined Formula because I've always had a passion for cars and I really wanted to get into the nitty-gritty of all the details of how to race a race car and get it running. I want to learn about cars and who doesn't you know, like building cars. I joined Western Formula Racing so I could see the skills that I developed in the classroom manifest in the workplace. I was really passionate about a show called Initial D, which is a racing anime, and it really got me into cars, and then when I got into mechanical, it made sense, you know. Formula gave me the biggest challenge, so I enjoyed being there, yeah. I joined Formula to gain more applicable knowledge that I can apply in the workforce later on and to gain more experience. Good. Probably cut off the last part. <laughs> <laughs> what is the biggest challenge you faced this year and how did you overcome it? Well, probably the biggest challenge for everyone was working and designing the car under COVID restrictions here at Western, especially with us not being able to come in and actually work on the car in person. My biggest challenge this year would have been learning to manage my time in order to maintain good grades in school while also being involved in my several extracurriculars. I think the biggest challenge that we faced this year is at least in our subsystem, was the spot welding of our battery. The biggest challenge I faced this year was probably trying to actually put myself out there in the club and ask questions and be confident. Um, our team was stunted in terms of manufacturing during the COVID lockdown in the beginning of second semester. The biggest issue I faced this year was the lack of knowledge transfer due to not having previous subsystem leads on the team this year. Since we have a really heavy first year schedule, it was finding time to fit in to come out to Formula. So we had to go through a couple months of testing and seeing where we can get our batteries spot loaded, how feasible it was. Just as of yesterday, we got it fully finished. The modules are all spot loaded and we're looking good till the rest. It really gave me a lot of confidence when I started doing tasks and I was, I was like really sure of what I was doing, especially if it was like something that was going on the car. So that was something that I overcame this year. As soon as we got back into the shop, we had one big burst to kind of catch 
get back on pace with everything. The way I overcame that was by, instead of developing tunnel vision, reaching out to the team leads uh, and making sure that I was still able to perform my tasks to the best of the abilities and understanding that, the, understanding that at the end of the day, this is a team sport. But I knew that at the end of the day, uh, if I really wanted to, I could make time for it, and that's what I ended up doing to get involved. What is something you learned while working on formula this year? I learned a lot about how to prep and do an infusion for our carbon fiber component and all of the stuff surrounded that. Something that I learned in formula this year was um, I learned how to CAD and I think it's a pretty useful skill. Above all else, teamwork is what makes the dream work. I first learned formula, I knew nothing about cars and now I know the effects of aerodynamics on the car. Something that I learned at Portland this year, I didn't learn anything. No, I was gonna say I learned more than one thing. I learned way too many things. I learned how to how to use a gun to paint the parts, the aero parts. I learned carbon fiber infusions, um, sanding, using power tools, just so many different things that are gonna be so helpful later on in my career. So yeah. I learned a lot more about composites by working on some of this team and how you can make stronger structures out of composites as opposed to regular steel tube structures. I learned that a lot of the times you might think you know everything, but there's always someone who knows more and it's a great experience uh, for learning and developing your knowledge. A big thing I learned this year was learning to run CNC machines and also PCB design. I have learned quite a lot of electrical. It's really broadening my mechanical mindset, I, I would say. And it's allowing me to look at things from a different point of view and kind of seeing a more delicate point of view instead of just thinking like with a hammer, as most mechanical students do. How has formula impacted your career? It has definitely expanded on my knowledge learned in class, especially not being in engineering. Uh, Formal has helped me gain a lot more hands-on and applicable experience that I can apply later on in the workforce. As a first-year student, um, Formula has really given me the experience to develop my skills both technically and academically. Formula has impacted my career in the form of networking, so when you have Formula listed as one of your experiences, it really shows employers that you have put a lot of work into something that's quite difficult to do and you are able to learn new things and apply things that really aren't that easy. I learned about battery management systems and it's a really interesting side of programming that I've never really thought about. So that's something that I want to look more into and maybe advance in this side of programming. I've got a lot of good internship, internship opportunities and uh, also provide a extremely valuable and applicable experience. Western Formula Racing has equipped me with the tool set that will allow me to tackle my ambitions out in the real workplace. Formula has allowed me to network with plenty of industry professionals, which has allowed me to get a work placement this summer. Formula has impacted my career by opening many doors and opportunities for me. Really has broadened my horizons in the mechanical field. Building a race car is a pretty technical activity. I'm able to manage like the blitz load of the Formula uh, role in school, I think it helps um, even in a world like that when it's not purely technical. I feel like I've applied to the end of the formula every day. Initially, I wasn't sure what I wanted to do, but now I'm quite confident I want to do something related to vehicles, especially like race cars. Why do you think the support of sponsors and faculty is so important to the team? The faculty helps us with a lot of testing and access to different shops, as well as just with different sponsors giving us material we need and allowing us to work with them to make some of the more difficult and challenging components. Without sponsors or the support of our faculty members, we would never be able to do all the amazing things we do on this team, and it is only with your continued support that we've been able to make it this far. We have designed kind of sit down and talk to them, we talk about our design, alter our design, and really improve upon it. And most of all, they allow us to work in their own environments and take us on board as co-op students. Uh, thank you, Paul. Thank you, Elizabeth. Hello. We wouldn't have the quality materials that we're able to use. The support of the faculty and the sponsors to our team ensures that we get to build each and every single year a brand new monocle. Without the support of our sponsors and the faculty, I don't think this team would exist. It's, a, it's an entire ecosystem that makes the team survive. Um, the students and, and the, yeah, I guess the students can focus on the only with a portion of that ecosystem. The others are obviously sponsors, faculty. Um, it all kind of works together uh, to make one cohesive unit every year. What has been your favorite memory on the team so far? 
Favorite memory would definitely be back in first year when we used to do design in the fall semester. We all got together in one of the in one of the computer labs and had F1 the races on on Sunday mornings. I woke up in a hammock in a field of cows to then immediately go on to the racetrack in Toronto and then watch our Formula car go racing around the circuit. To be honest, my favorite moment has not even been when we were actually working on the car. It was more of just when we were sitting in the office and we were just talking and relaxing during like a good break between working. And we would just have like the funniest conversations and that was really memorable to me. My favorite memory on the team was seeing the monocoque fully manufactured for the first time and seeing how our work brought it to come together and look good. My favorite moment here at Western Formula Racing was during the Toronto shootout where we watched the car get repaired mid-race when something broke. My favorite moment this year so far would be just seeing everyone at a meeting and then just get to work on the car on the group and just vibing to the music. My favorite memories on the Western Formula team has been staying up late and having some long nights to get things done. It's always really satisfying to see things come together and get them done, so that's been my favorite part of the whole team. Thank you for all your support. Thank you for 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 all your support. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your support. We should have a blooper drill. Formula Western. Wow. Excellence, enthusiasm, and endurance. No. Endurance, excellence, and enthusiasm. Excellence, endurance, and enthusiasm. Okay. Um. <laughs> no, no, no. Thank you for all your support. Appreciate it. Thank you for all your support. I might. Thank you for all your support. Thank you for 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 your support. I stick to engineering and not active. I'm very good. Thank you for your support. Thank, Thank you, you for all your support. <laughs> <laughs>